as you guys know, whenever I go to an anime convention, there's a thing where I always seem to buy like a bag. I really like the aesthetics of bags of like certain anime bags. I even made a full anime drip episode of me sharing my bags and stuff like my anime bags. If you guys want to check that out, check it out. Links will be in the description below. But I thought I would show you guys what I use and what's inside my bag because I don't think I've ever done one of these. This is like different from what I carry at a convention because at a convention, I'm kind of like stocked with like my DSLR and everything that comes with it. So it's, it's a little bit different in this sense. But here's what I daily drive. I'm currently da daily driving this offset bag. Uh, it's actually one of those that when you have flash on it, like it changes color and is like, it's pretty cool. And with the offset strat, it's really cool. And of course I have a Takanashi Kiara keychain that I got from a fellow KFP member at a convention. She was cosplaying Takanashi Kiara. You would have seen her like do wobbles with me. I even interviewed her in the anime impulse OC. So yeah, this, uh, this was from her. KFP stand up. On the back side, I actually have my wallet. I have a big your wallet i want to get a ridge wallet eventually but the thing is like they're really expensive <laughs> i know it's worth the price but i i could spend hundred dollars on something else you know it's uh it's something that I, I can't do it. <laughs> I'm not gonna show you what's inside my my wallet, my debt. Next inside it's pretty cool. It's pretty compact. If you guys want to see what the front says that's what it says in the front you guys can pause it and check that out. Front pocket I have some gum I have an extra camera battery for my uh, my mirrorless camera, my M50, when I like vlog and stuff, because you never know. I have an extra mask if I need it. And then I have extra small batteries for what I'm going to show you guys next. These are extra batteries for a Canon ELF 108 HS that I bring with me everywhere. Uh, it's, it's a point and shoot camera that uh, I found in my storage. There is a YouTuber that I watch. I believe he goes by King Japes. He does a lot of thrifting on like older point and shoot cameras. He also buys like cheaper cameras from like target like the film cameras and stuff he's he's a really cool youtuber he has like 150,000 subscribers i just started watching him recently and uh, i just think he's uh, a really cool follow so if you guys are interested in like more camera stuff go follow him but what i have in my what i have in the main pocket first off is uh i carry oh i always carry a cologne of what i want to smell this time i had uh i i'm subscribed to scentbird uh, this is not sponsored by Sendbird because, you know, they don't, they're not going to sponsor me. Uh, but l listen, weebs, it's okay to smell good, okay? You can smell good. You could shower. It's not a bad thing. Uh, I have ash. This is the smell ash. It smells... It smells really good actually <laughs> so i carry it everywhere but pretty much it's a monthly subscription where you can like get different scents yeah it's either monthly bi-monthly i do it monthly but i paused it this month because i'm poor it sucks that i'm poor on my birthday next i have a mini tripod for my phone as well as i could unscrew this and it could be for like my smaller point and shoot camera this is a miniature gorilla pod that i got for 30 dollars at best buy of course i have carmex lip balm <laughs> you can't forget the Carmex. And then the piece de resistance. We have the Canon PowerShot Elf 100 HS. So this is what I carry. It's a 12.1 megapixel camera, which is like the same as the iPhone actually. But there's something, there's there's a feeling about shooting on your camera, uh, shooting on your, you know, your cellular device versus shooting on an actual camera. It just feels kind of liberating. I don't know, I just like shooting on this. I got it from, like like I said, from watching King Japes and I was talking about it with Rod and it's, it just feels different shooting on a camera, you know, and it, it makes you focus. I don't know, it just makes me want to take shots of like things that I see. And I've been posting on Twitter, my random shots that I take, even if it's shots of myself in my office. So yeah, this is what I carry. Now, one thing that I wish that I can have in this bag that I ordered, but I got scammed on AliExpress was a Miu Mini. I wanted a Miu Mini so bad. The V, I think it was a V2 or a V3. I don't remember, but I did order it on AliExpress. Ended up getting scammed. Got my money back, but it was just a really sad time. So I just been looking at like different emulator pocket things, but I really wanted the Miu Mini. I also like the, I think it's a, a RGX 35XX. I think it was what it's called but i really like that one too but i like how small the miu mini is but i might go with uh the other one because the miu mini people are hella overpriced in that shit and when uh, unfortunately i wish this bag could fit my switch oled <laughs> but it doesn't fit my switch oled so usually my switch oled would go in my backpack when i'm like going to cons or something or if i'm traveling somewhere and i want to have a switch on me it would be on my backpack so i would usually carry this with my backpack and I'm sure you've guys seen my backpack at cons, you know, like I've, I'm always wearing it. Um, I might change it up a bit. I love all, all my bags are usually from Offset um, or it's from Nothing Gold. Uh, but then, 
you know i i like seeing the different types of bags from like anime inspired streetwear companies i just think they're really cool but yeah this is my daily driver this is what i carry in my bag and this is the bag that i use you know it's a uh, it's meant it could be used as a, a a thigh strap i think you could strap it to your leg or your thigh but obviously i'm not trying to show my thighs like that i just have it as like a side bag like i would put it over put it over like this or i could have it as like a a waist bag but usually i carry it like this because it's handy because i can sw switch it around if i see something that i want to take a picture of i grab it take my camera turn it on and then like i i just shoot you know so that's usually what i do uh, at a convention uh, i would probably have more of uh, my batteries and i would probably have like an extra lens on me like this 20 mil you know um for my uh for my m50 so i would have more uses for like uh, vlog stuff when i have this but i would also have my backpack attached to it. so yeah that's what's uh, that's what's inside my bag really short video i wish i wish i had the miu mini 